some very very kind person sent us a button badge and I don't know who it is because there was no note but it came from our Amazon wish list. it's been sitting in there for quite some time <laughs> um, but thank you so much um, I've never made button badges before so <laughs> this will be really cool and uh, they're going to be of key I've already had some sheets printed out the button press comes with a circle cutter which is this, it's got a blade there yeah, it's not the uh, the safest because the blade actually sticks out, but um, it does the job. But I didn't want to use this kind, so I bought a punch, which is this, and it's the exact size, which is one and three quarter inch. I've cut them into strips so that they can fit into the press. Just like that. Bags. These are the bags for the button, and then those are the front clips, and it comes with a load of clear plastic that goes on the front to protect the paper design and then just line it up just lining up the design and then and then the little circle the back has a wiggly bit and the pin so the wiggly bit obviously goes on the inside the pin has an orientation so it's got a little hook there so you want this to be the right way up and then on the other side, you put the metal bit, which has got a groove there, and then the domed bit face up. Then you put your picture on top, and because I've orientated the, um, the pin backing to be towards me, I have to make sure that the image is the same way, so I don't want to put it in that way up, because then it would be upside down. So I need to go that way. Goes in there. Um, and then clear piece of plastic. Put a bit of plastic case on the top. Right, so then you move this over to this side and you press that handle down. And then slide it over and you press it down extra firm on this side. <laughs> and then you got a button badge. <laughs> so cool! Every single time, it's so cool. And then I've got many of these already cut out. And then one of these. Yep, you just stand in front of that camera. Oh, hang on, I've got fluffs in it. You might end up with the uh, keys fluff captured inside your button pad if you order one. I'm trying to not to. So, well, I had a got four pairs in there. Don't back up too much. Are you looking for the jerky? Can I help you? <laughs> and we've got a little weirdo. How good is that? I love that face, that's so funny. And that on the back. <laughs> so cool. Okay, you can have a bit more jerky. You didn't find it. Goodie bed. You down in your bed. Good boy. Thank you. I could literally do this for hours. It's so <laughs> relaxing. I forgot to do a fluff check, but there's none in there, thankfully. Blem. <laughs> Oops. So I'm not entirely certain on the quality of the badges, and um, when I was testing them out, I did end up having one that fell apart, and I don't know if it's just because I didn't press hard enough on the second portion, pushing it into the backing, but the back and the front came apart. Um, I have test tugged <laughs> these a bit to, to see if they'll come apart but um, I don't want to sell button badges if they could potentially come apart I don't want people to spend money and it break apart after a short time after just normal use so I have a plan and I would like you guys to test the badges for us and to do that if you place an order through Designed by Boo, my website there's a link in the description 
If you place an order during November and December this year, so up until the end of the year, um, add a little note, there's a note section when you're placing your order, say button please or badge please and I will put a free badge, one of these at random, will be placed into your order um, free of charge so you can test it out for me and then you can get back to me and tell me whether it fell apart or whether it's great or whatever you think about it. Um, so I won't be selling any of these button badges until next year. Um, so long as this machine is good enough to make ones that don't fall apart. Um, that's the only way you can have them, so you can't leave a comment on this video <laughs> asking for a free badge because you can't, I'm afraid. It has to come with an order that you're placing, a physical order, so it can't be a color, it can't be a colouring book page that um, are free because I don't post those. But the, um, the badge will be covered by your postage for whatever order you, you make through my website. Um, and then I'll pop a little badge in as well. Does it sound good? Does it sound good? Yeah? You look totally confused. I'd love that. People would like to have a button badge, don't you think? What do you think? Is that a good idea? People can have a little badge with, with your face on it. You don't want to eat it. It's got a pin on the back, Kiki. It's got your face. It's your face. Yeah. <laughs> it's you. And people can have them for free for a short time so that they can test them out and see if they are sellable. What do you think? Good? Is that a good idea? Yeah, it's you. Is that a good idea? <coughs> wow, that was so loud. Not so loud, Key. <laughs> Ask your lovely fans to try out the button badges for us, please. <laughs> look at your cute face. <laughs> you don't want to look at your cute face, so you going into your ear. Okay. So these are the badges that you could end up with. Let me know which one is your favourite. I can't decide, but I really love this one. It says what on it? It's definitely one of my favourites. <laughs> what? Oh no! Oh no! You're all over the paper, Key! You might get one with a bit of dribble and a, a claw mark. <laughs> You're a vandal. So this is the right way up for the hook. So it goes face down. Move that over. Remember to put that piece in. Put the design in. Take some plastic, defluff it. If you have an extra hairy fluff maker in the house. Put that in there. Try not to hit your camera whilst filming. Press down. Move over to the other side. Oops. Hit your camera because for some reason this one this time it hit. <laughs> I think it goes down lower. <laughs> um, press down extra firm on this one. And then you have a button. I have a cup full of button badges. The, it's, it's kind of addictive to make these. There's a link in the description for my website, but it's designed by boo.com. If you weren't aware, we have lots of merchandise on there, including lots of out key. We've got t-shirts and tote bags and cushions, like that one up there, and then that one over there. Christmas cards and, again, wrapping paper. We've got colouring books, 22 pages to colour. And get him rolling and waving. <laughs> we all know how reluctant he is. Uh, what have we got? Trying to catch balls. More rolling. That's him with his best friend. I can actually say Sherpa because he's not in the room. <laughs> uh, dressed as a pirate. Singing with a microphone. Him and his waffles. 
I've also got an adult colouring book, which is more intricate designs, and the key is in this one as well, but this is a collection of different dogs, so the key is the first page, and then it's all snow dogs, so there's Jabba, Key's best friend, and then there's lots of other huskies. So that says on the back there are 26 pages to colour in and there's also an info page about all the dogs that I drew that are in there so these are all, um, they all include key in them so there's, there's key at the front there on that one so there's key again and then there's this Christmas card this is our snow dog selfie design and this is the Christmas version of it so it's like the cushion I have um, but they've got that Santa hat on Key, and there's reindeer horns on Nanook, which is Key's older brother. And then there's Sherpa. It's weird being able to say his name, but Key's not in the room, so it's fine. Uh, and then these are all actual dogs again. This is the cushion. You've probably seen it in some of my videos. It's so soft. This one's covered in fluff there, because Key sits up here. But there's Key and Sherpa. And there's Nanook down there, and that dog is called Dragon, and there's Anuko, and there's Belto, and there's this very hairy cushion, which is this key's howling one. There's a black version, and there's a black and teal version. So here's my little logo.